Hey guys, it's Patrick Star. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am giving you a very requested tutorial for brown eyes. This is a makeup look for my brown eye girls out there. Normally you guys know that I wear these light gray contacts which look blue on me. No, I am not insecure about my eyes nor do I want to change my eye color. I just love the art of makeup and fantasy and transformation. I am a little drag queen. So this look is super simple. It is very easy. I am wearing minimal blush, minimal on the eyes. I just really wanted to do a tutorial you guys can wear day to day. You guys don't have to wear as much foundation as I'm wearing. This is kind of like a hybrid tutorial. It is a full coverage tutorial slash makeup for brown eyes. If you guys recreate this look, please tag me on social media, follow me on Instagram, on Twitter, on Facebook, and Snapchat, and let's get right into the tutorial. All right guys, so I'm gonna start off with this EX1 foundation. As you guys can clearly see, I have been loving it. And I'm just gonna take it on my brush and just squirt it on there. And this is the Morphe M427 brush. And I'm just gonna blend this all over my face. This foundation is amazing. It's lightweight and it's pretty full coverage and it looks amazing on camera and I love it. It's the EX1 foundation and I'm in the color F400. Oh my God, I forgot to prime. Ain't nobody got time for primer, but that's okay. Also, another big tip for your life, not just makeup or any aspect of your life, is to stop bullying. I am wearing a shirt that promotes anti-bullying, kiss and... Oh, look at my waist, though. Yes, waist? Yeah, kiss and makeup. Stand up for your friends. Stand up for those that are less fortunate. And just stop bullying. Let's make the world a better place. All right, you guys, so next, I'm gonna add some fuller coverage because you know I do have facial hair. I haven't got a laser. I'm gonna take the MAC Full Coverage Foundation, and it is very sad. But you know when you see something that hits pan, you, it means it's good, okay? And I'm gonna take my Morphe M439 brush. This is amazing. I'm gonna snatch the edges of the foundation pan, and I'm just gonna go over my stubble, and this will just add, you see the discoloration? Can you guys see in HD? Hopefully in HD. If not, watch it in HD. And we're just gonna go over our manhood. Next, I'm gonna take my Boing Concealer and I'm gonna snatch my face. This concealer is by Benefit Cosmetics in the shade number two. I'm going to snatch my face. I love this concealer. It's industrial strength and it is amazing. And you can get this at Sephora. And I love it because there's like a peach undertone. Next, I'm going to blend the concealer using the G2 brush by Morphe. Don't forget to use the discount code PSTAR in all caps to get a discount on all things Morphe. There's like a beauty blender on a stick. Oh my God, I am shook, you guys. Look, I don't took off the little filter. Is it called a filter? Strainer? Drainer. Filter. Sifter. I done took off the sifter of this so I can get all the excess product. This is about $30 cent right here, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my puff and I'm gonna bake this damn face. Yes. Yes, powder. Moving on to the eyes, I'm gonna take the famous 35O palette. This one though is the matte version. So I'm gonna take this shade right here and blend it throughout the eye with my Morphe M504 brush and slay this transition crease. Guys, really quick, I wanted to point out my two favorite brushes. This one is by Morphe, the M504. And this one is the Sigma E40 brush. They're literally the same. This is just a little bit fluffier and more tapered. And these are amazing for blending your crease and snatching your eyelids, okay? So next, I'm gonna take this Morphe brush, the M503, and I'm gonna take this brown shadow right here, and I'm gonna slay the crease. I'm just gonna bring and flick up this blend, flick it up to Jesus, yes, blend. You see that? That's not blended, that's called a horse line. We gotta get rid of it. So I'm gonna take this highlight shade right here and I'm gonna put it on the brow bone to get rid of that line. Yes! I'm gonna blend it, don't you worry. So next I'm gonna take the 35OS, the 35O Shimmer Palette, and I'm gonna take this beautiful, oh, oh look, it matches my nail, honey. And then you shall so bright like diamond in the sky. <gasps> yes. It's a beautiful color. I'm going to take that and put that on my lid. Next, I'm going to curl my lashes up to Jesus. Yes, God. So next, I'm going to take Benefit Roller Lash Mascara. This is like my favorite mascara for 
curling up to Jesus. Now we're gonna roll up to Jesus because it's called roller lash. It really helps hold the curl. A lot of other mascaras are heavy in the formula, but this is meant for curling and I like that because you know, I got Asian hair lashes and they're non-existent. So I really, really, really love this. Next is lashes. I'm gonna skip eyeliner. I'm gonna use the pink box lashes from Lily Lashes in the luxury collection. This is in the style Opulence, and I'm gonna put this on my lashes to give it a pretty wispy effect. Next for the face, I'm gonna take the Makeup Pro Finish Powder, and I'm gonna dust this all over the face to take away the translucent powder sitting on top. Next, I'm gonna take the same foundation powder in a lighter color, in the color 128. This is the Makeup Forever Pro Finish Powder, and I'm gonna pat this underneath the eyes to give me that clean, highlighted effect. Just wanna dab this. Next, I'm gonna take the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Dark, and just bronze up the face just so slightly. I love these types of powders from MAC because they're mineral powders. They're not foundation powders like what I used right before this. These powders sit nice on the skin. So if you guys want a more natural finish, something more satin, something that's not so full coverage, the Mineralized Skin Finishes by MAC, it's amazing. It's like the title, Skin Finish, and it's mineral. So it's very, very lightweight on the skin and it gives you a beautiful finish. And I love using these types of powders for my bronzers. Take that same powder and we're gonna snatch the nose. Next, I'm gonna take my Clinique Bottom Mascara and I'm gonna coat my lashes. Look how tiny she is. Next, I'm gonna take the Goof Proof Brow Pencil by Benefit Cosmetics. One has a brush and the other side has the actual product and I'm going to do my brows. Snatch these caterpillars. The lip liner that I'm gonna use is my favorite Cafe Ole by Rimmel. And I'm going to wear Jeffree Star's Gemini on the lips. Last but not least, one of my favorite blushes is by Tarte in the color Captivating with my M527 brush by Morphe. It is so peachy and pretty. And this about completes this look. All right, you guys, this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoy this beautiful makeup for brown eyes. It is not just for brown eyes. Anyone could wear it. It is super simple. It's minimal. You could wear this to school, picking up the groceries. If you're about to pass your neighbor that's really hot, go to school, anything. It's very simple. It's super easy. And I hope you guys try this at home. If you guys have any questions, let me know down in the comments below. I'll try to respond as much as I can. All the products are listed below too. If you guys like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video.